Hello, we're going to watch a mock OET speaking test. The setting is a neurology ward and it's a patient who's very reluctant about undergoing an MRI. So let's see how the nurse convinces the patient in undertaking the MRI. Shruti, you have five minutes for the role play card and your time starts now. Good morning, Sarah. Good morning. How are you doing today? I'm really not well. See, I've been throwing up the entire morning and I have the splitting headache as well. Okay. So have you taken your pain medication? I've been taking them at least, uh, you know, for the last one week I've been taking the painkillers and I'm worried about the usage of painkillers also. Okay, but the doctor has suggested for an MRI scan. Mm -hmm. So are you ready to do it? Um, I mean, can I have a way out? Is it really necessary for me to go for an MRI? Uh, see, Sarah, it will be better for you to opt this uh, MRI because you will, uh, you will be ready to know your problems. You'll get to know what you're up to or uh, mm -hmm. about your condition might be. Uh, but you see the doctor did explain about what the MRI is all about, how it's done and I'm, to be honest, I'm really scared of these closed tight spaces and I'm, I'm not sure if I'll be ready for it. Don't worry about that, we'll be always around you to assist you. Mm -hmm. So you can go for it and in case of emergency, if you want to go through, like if you're feeling anything uncomfortable, you can always call us, we'll be there immediately. Okay, but I'm still confused about it. Okay, fine. So if you're not comfortable with it, we have another option. Mm -hmm. uh, like I can talk to the doctor about giving you a sedative. Mm -hmm. And uh, you will be unconscious and then you can go for an MRI. Oh, maybe that sounds better. I mean, if you can give it a try. Okay, fine. So let's, let me talk about this to the doctor. Sure. So do you have any other concerns? Oh, uh, well, I do. I mean, there's a lot actually going on in my mind, you see. I've been here for a week. I don't know when I'll be discharged. And I actually also have a financial problem. So I'm thinking about it right now. Okay. So that's really worrying me. Mm -hmm. Don't worry about it. Like it, it is actually a part of everyone's life. Mm -hmm. So might be if you're good in your health, you can go and solve all your financial problems later on. Ah, uh, yeah. So I just want to know when I can actually go home because I've been here for a week and I don't know anything about the discharge. So and like I said, you know, I'm I'm the person who earns for my family. So okay. when do you think I can you know, leave and go home then? Okay, so once we just finish our MRA mm -hmm. and then we will just find out if there, any, if there is anything wrong with mm -hmm. you mm -hmm. and if there is anything wrong, we can take certain treatments mm -hmm. for it and once you're fine, you mm -hmm. can leave home. Um, by the way, the doctor also told me something about neurological signs and some terms that he used. What is wrong with me? Do you think there's anything wrong? No, there's nothing wrong with you. Mm -hmm. So once the MRA is out, we can like we can find out uh, what is wrong with you. Mm -hmm. So it is really necessary for you to go with the MRA now. Okay. All right. So do you have anything else in your mind? Mm, uh, no, just this headache and all the worries about I've actually kept my um, house it's on mortgage mm -hmm. I've you know taken a hefty sum from the bank and I haven't uh, paid some of my installments and I don't know when I'll be able to do it so all of these you know in my mind and that's really causing all the problems okay so if you are really concerned about that uh, might be I can talk to a social worker regarding this mm -hmm. she can help you outside the hospital mm -hmm. okay okay Maybe that'll help, not sure though. 
Okay, so maybe I'll talk to a social worker mm -hmm. so that she can help you with all your problems regarding your financial mm -hmm. securities. Mm -hmm. Okay, maybe that will help then. All right, thank you for that. Okay, fine. So is there anything that is bothering you now? Mm, no, since you told me that I have an option for the MRI, I think that should be fine. Please do doc uh, talk to the doctor about that. Yes, yeah, sure. I'll talk to the doctor regarding this. Mm -hmm. And then I will get in touch with you very soon. Mm -hmm. So we have discussed about the problem you're facing regarding the closed spaces. And I have given you an option for sedative. And let me discuss about this to the doctor. Mm -hmm. And I will let you know his response. And I will also talk to the social worker regarding your problems mm -hmm. and uh, I will just confirm her response also and I will let you know about it. Okay. Thank you Shruti. That's the end of your time. Thank you. Med City International Academy. Trusted hands forever.